Well, hello everybody. Happy Friday. Happy weigh-in day for me. Um, my goodness, it's been a great, great week, you guys. Um, I hope it's been a good week for you. Um, it is the most wonderful week of the month for me. So, um, trying to be discreet. So, that's always a week that I'm not really sure exactly what I'll get on the scale. But, um, I'll tell you about that in just a few seconds. This week at the Weight Watchers meeting, we talked about protein power. Protein. And you know what? I feel like this week, the meeting was such a confirmation for me. Because I, last week, kind of got on a place where I felt like... I need to look into some things that are going on with my body. Um, new ages, new stages, new things happening. Um, it's probably just time. My body has, um, if you've been with me since the beginning or you've watched for any amount of time, you have seen my struggles with making things happen on the scale. Um, I have been pretty diligent with this program. Um, I can't even there's been one week in over 20 where I can definitely say that I've eaten over my points. Um, it has been a journey for sure of figuring things out, of making it work for my particular body. And so last week I was really trying to get down to the bottom of what feels like or what seems like maybe some metabolic issues that I'm having. Because now that I can say that I definitely have the exercise piece in place, um, I have my water in place, I definitely have the food in place, um, there's, to me, there, I, I feel like there has to be something going on in your body when your losses are low. Um, not that that's completely bad because, as I stated last week in my um, video a 0.5 to 2 pounds loss is the average and that is what's healthy uh, however I have been at the low end of that spectrum the very very low end of that spectrum not quite at the 0.5 but probably anywhere from 0.8 to right at 1 pound 0.8 is a pretty good loss for me um, and so I'm really really considering looking into some holistic um, treatments. Maybe I want to see a holistic doctor and maybe have some tests run just to see if there's anything going on. Um, it was like an epiphany moment for me last week when I realized thyroid issues run in my family. So that may be something that I might be struggling with and it would be very helpful for me to look into that. So that is something that is on my radar and I am going to look into. Um, whether it is to see a holistic practitioner or to maybe look into some of the supplements and begin to incorporate those. So we shall see. But about weigh in today, I don't want to prolong that very much. So it is the most wonderful time of the month for me. So I never know what that's going to bring. Last week on the scale was an exciting week after two weeks of gains and getting very frustrated so much that I just didn't even really want to show my face out here in YouTube land. Um, I lost 3.2 last week and so with it being shark week and with not knowing you know after a big loss um, what was going to show up I was pleasantly surprised today to have another 0.8 loss. So, I can never get this to focus for you guys. So, if you can see it, fantastic. I'm sorry if you can't. I always want to be honest. Um, so, that brings my weight down to 294.8. And that is a total loss of 17.2 pounds with Weight Watchers. My total, um, before that, I lost about 10 pounds before I started. So, I'm getting close to the 30 pound mark. Um, all total which is very exciting beginning to see some really strong NSVs um, in my clothes um, waistbands which is fantastic because that means it's all in the right place we want to get rid of that bad fat in the middle area um, and I can definitely see that that's where the weights coming off um, you know in those places that we really need it to so I'm very excited about that and like I said this topic today about protein 
Um, I'm just going to leave you with one of the tips. If you go to meetings, read this weekly. It was really fantastic. But I want to share with all of you one of the tips that my leader pointed out today. And it is aim to eat 8 grams of protein daily for every 20 pounds that you weigh. Can you imagine that? Like I know for sure. I am not doing that. So it says if you weigh 180 pounds, for example, you would aim for 72 grams of protein. 180 is like my goal weight. <laughs> I am so far and I have so, so far to go to get there. So I know that I am by no means eating anywhere near 108, uh, 72 grams of protein. So I'm going to do this this week and see if this doesn't make a big difference. I had that in the back of my head because I know that my body does respond very well to low carb, um, low carb and pro higher levels of protein. So I'm going to make that change this week and see if that does not do something fantastic for me on the scale. I would love to continue to see this trend of weight loss um, keep happening in my life. So anyway, thanks for being here. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch. Um, to all of my new subscribers, it is awesome to have you guys. It is wonderful to meet you all. And um, please be very vocal, leave comments. Um, I will definitely, I try my best to get around to all of you who are making videos because we need, we really need the support. And um, just to know that we're not alone on this journey and that somebody understands the craziness that happens along the way. So I'm here for you. Thanks so much for being here for me. Um, and I'll see you again real soon. If you've enjoyed this video and the way I see it, please like, comment, and be sure to subscribe. I love having you around. We'll see you tomorrow.